It's a nice warm day in the high 70s here in the uh, vegetable demonstration garden or one of a series of gardens I have here at the house that I've planted to one enjoy the uh, nice fresh produce but two is to use as an educational medium to talk about pests and diseases and how to control them with natural means or least toxic means and at some point during the day this tomato hornworm moth has arrived and taken residency on of course a tomato plant this moth actually was pupating all winter long in the soil doubt it was in here but could have been and then flew on and is going to then lay its eggs that will hatch into those large or develop into those large green tomato hornworms this is a pest that can be substantially controlled by applying beneficial nematodes to the garden soil there are several species of beneficial nematodes and I'm not going to go into each of those species here but not all beneficial nematodes control all pests also once your crop is developing and you have lots of critters coming and going by releasing trichogramma species and green lacewing into your garden you can um, get a lot of control that way trichogramma will hunt down the eggs of this moth and insert their egg into its egg and green lacewing will simply just eat the eggs this is the adult version of the tomato green green tomato hornworm Ugh, a lot of going on there